Royalty is with us, Jamie Lee Curtis. Hello, my friends. Well, so this is how you do Halloween in Australia, huh? This is how we gear up for it. Oh, wait until it's over. You people will be on the floor. Are you? Uh, yeah. How good is it to see this lady in our country here? She flew, she flew in the swine. Oh, yeah. She flew in the, well, how is she going to get it? She yeah. flew in the swine. She's been working all day talking about this film, which has set box office records around the world. What's it taken, like a hundred million dollars in like Some two or three like days that. or something? I mean, how cool is that? Who's counting? Well, you are. You know, the odd thing about that, the truth of the matter is, uh, the first Halloween was made uh, for $300,000 in 20 days, and not one person involved with that original movie ever thought it would be anything. We just didn't know. We all were young. The oldest person was 30. We were just a group of young filmmakers, and we made a movie, and it turned out to be something that people liked. So the thing that I, you know, I'm old, and, and no, I'm just being honest, and, you know, in my oldness, I also got a little tiny bit competitive. And so the whole idea of a movie doing super well and it becomes all about money, I am telling you now, whatever happens, this movie was not made by the filmmakers to make money. It was made because David Gordon Green, who's the director, Danny McBride, who wrote it with David Gordon Green, loved Halloween, loved it. It was a super big part of their life when they were young filmmakers, and they just wanted an opportunity to tell a story about 40 years of trauma between Michael Myers and Morris Road. And that is why we all went and made it. And I'm, the only reason I'm saying that is because we can get lost in how much money it's gonna make, but that's not why we made it. We made it because we wanted to preserve the integrity of the original story and the relationship. So, there have been what? 11 Halloween movies? There have been 11. 11 Halloween movies. Um, but this one. Or as my husband would have said in Spinal Tap. Yeah, it went to 11. So, to 11. Sorry. Boom, boom. All right. I mean, I it's said very to, rare I can do that, so. I said. <laughs> Said put it that we need another Spinal Tap movie. Yeah. He's out fishing, goddamn. Yeah. 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 Hey, um, so but this film follows on from the first one, like all those other uh, nine, just sort of you know a little sidebars, so to speak. Well, no. Here's okay. the, the in order for David and Danny to come up with this movie, which will scare you, I promise you. They needed to just connect the dot back to 1978. What happened to Laurie Strode on October 31st, 1978, and what happens to Laurie Strode October 31st, 2018, period. Those two dots. If you connect those two dots, you have this movie, and you will see at the end of it why that was necessary. For me to tell you would be what they call spoiler alerts. And I'm not going to do that, even though you are from Australia, and I'm sure you would appreciate and understand if I did, but I'm not going to, and you can't. And you can't even offer me some of your popcorn to get me to do it. However, everybody should still be here at the end of the credits, if they're still oh, alive. They should, right? Listen, if you're still alive at the end of this movie, um, that'll be good news. So, a couple more questions. Why? What? 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 Why what do you want to know, Dan? Why do, Tell me, what do you why want? Why do good people spend hard-earned cash to get the, the Jesus skit out of them? You know what, if I knew that, I would be a rich woman. Um, here's what I can tell you. We don't know each other. You guys may know me or think you know me because you've seen me in things or whatever. Uh, I'm sure if we all spent uh, an afternoon together in a big group therapy session. <laughs> we might all get to know each other a little bit. But I will tell you this, it doesn't matter where I am in the world, I can be anywhere in the world. And you bring a group of people together in the dark, and you scare them together. It's an experience. And I don't know why we like it. 
But somehow, if I was an amateur psychologist, I would tell you that somehow the world out there is very scary, and that when we come in here in the dark together in a safe place and watch something really scary, we have the experience, we get the release of it, and then we can go back out into the world somehow better because we've been through something together as a group. And I don't know why that is, and uh, I seriously can't explain it, but there is something that happens as you're very soon about to find out. Yeah. Well, this film is way too scary, scary for, uh, I've seen it once, so. You know. So you're leaving? Absolutely, you've seen it. You I'm in it, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I am it. Well, are you going to watch it again? No. no. <laughs> Let me just remind you all. I, I don't know if you heard at the beginning of his comments, I flew here today. Correct. That means I started out in Los Angeles, California, and I ended up in Sydney, Australia. <laughs> and then I got off a plane and started my work. So I'm slightly, you're wondering probably why I'm like slightly yeah, I'm like, to, I'm listening a little. Um, I probably might be a good idea to eat something and then yeah. fall deep into a vat of sleep before I get up tomorrow morning and go on your morning. You're going on our rival show. We won't mention that, yes. <laughs> Sunset. Rival? Yeah. yeah, thanks for bringing that up. Uh, no, but let's really talk about the rival thing. Hey, listen. No, no, I'm serious. Let's just talk about it. Why, why is the rival? <laughs> is there not enough to go the fuck around? <laughs> Alive. Do we really need to be like in a rivalry about TV and people watching it? Well, I have spent the day with you today and I wouldn't trade that for the world. Aww. And ladies and gentlemen, I wish you all a very How lucky are we to have this lady enjoy the movie? Put your hands together for Jamie Lee Curtis and enjoy Halloween. It's in the cinemas on Thursday. That's if you live long enough.